Mistakes were costly to both teams. This time it was Western forcing the turnover and Jim Rose scoring. With a chance to clinch victory, Glover's layup refused to drop. And Villanova had one last chance. Let's go, Western! Let's go, Western! Western Kentucky, the team of destiny. We're going all the way, baby! Everyone, Western Kentucky included, knew the Wildcats would look for Porter. And with eight seconds remaining, he tied the game. On Porter's last basket, you could find no fault with the Western defense. It was plainly an extraordinary effort which forced a double overtime. The complexion of the game changed drastically when Jim McDaniels was called for his fifth personal foul and dismissed from the game. Not having to contend with Big Mac, Porter ranged free, blocked two shots in 30 seconds. The outcome was becoming obvious. For the Hilltoppers, it was truly a shame that at their expense, Villanova had enjoyed its finest hour and advanced to the finals.